Greetings from Espo, Finland. My name is Elina Helqvist. I'm a Lutheran pastor and now acting director of the Office for Global Mission in my church, which is the Evangelical Lutheran Church of Finland. I had a chance to visit in Oman once, and one of the most impressive moments there was when we were taken out into the desert and we stayed overnight there. And very early in the morning, we got up, walked up on the hill, and we could see the sunrise over there. Now I'm here in a forest close by the city with my dog, and you can see the sun is setting right over there. For me, going into the forest is the best way to calm down after busy days and after busy working weeks. In the Bible, we can also read how Jesus, on those moments when he wanted to think about something or prepare himself for what was ahead of him, he went into the desert. And also, um, the night before he died, he went into a garden to pray there. I think he's setting a good example for us. Christians living in a very busy and a very modern age. We are somehow tied together with our mobile phones and tied together with our computers and we are always there to read the news from the world. We can hear suffering of the people all around of us, especially during these times when the COVID is really hitting hard communities around the globe. But at the times we need to cut ourselves out of those news feeds and out of social media and out of newspapers. We need um, quiet times. We need the wilderness around us. We need to see the nature. As you can see, there's still snow on the ground here in Finland. In news today, it was said that this is the first day of spring meaning that it's much warmer than it has been for, for quite some weeks. Or well, actually quite a few months. We had a really snowy and cold winter this time. And here, when I can hear the first birds singing and really not hear anything else except the birds and my dog who's playing around, um, I wish I can also hear the voice of God. I can hear what God wants me to do during these times, during these days before Easter. I hope you, my friend, wherever you are, you can find a way somehow to calm yourself, take time for yourself to pray and find out what's God's purpose for you. Be blessed and stay safe.